Hello my friends, I'm Rich Larson and I'm the ARC Tire Guy. Today we have some special footage courtesy of Elevated Action Sports. As I'm sure you know, here at IRC, we make the famous M5B Evo rear tire. This tire, which you may or may not know, has won more hill climbs than any other tire. Because we've made an amazing tire, we have the privilege of having amazing riders use our products. Now, Austin Tyler is a hill climb maniac. His all out and flashy style makes him truly one of my favorite riders to watch. Today, we have special footage of him testing his KX636 and his RMZ1000, both equipped with M5B Evo rear tires. I find this video really interesting to hear him talk about bike setup and feel of each machine. It really makes me ask the question, do you guys want to see me try these insane bikes? And maybe we can get some expert hill climb tips from Austin himself. Let us know your thoughts in the comments, make sure to subscribe, and please enjoy the video. Dude, it's so short. This thing's too short. You guys didn't move it back? Well, not 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 the 636. Oh, I thought you were gonna go to the left side. <laughs> no, I mean I I will. I almost feel like that's harder than that. Really? This is like you were clutching it pretty good, but like it's it was like when you got to about like right here, it was almost like you uh, didn't have the speed, you know? No. I'll go, I'll go left, like you said. Try that one. ground forever up the wall I was like oh crap I'm gonna shut it down and then as soon as I let it down it started hooking up again and I knew it I was like I think this is enough to scratch over the top and it was that was sketch though dude you worked for it man I got a little hairy dude I did not want to come off that ledge dude on this thing Yeah, I, I hit a hooner in it pretty bad. Dude, right here, bro, it's all undercut. Yeah, I, I thought I wheelied for it, but it didn't do nothing. You wheelied, but you landed up there. <laughs> I can't wait to see the GoPro footage of that. Dope.
is so fun to ride, it's like effortless. I don't even have it, I don't even have it buried at all. Hey, that wasn't even wide open. Yeah. It had to be four or five seconds faster than the 600 too. Dude. You blitzed up it without. I don't know. My eyes were starting to water, dude. I didn't know where I was at on the hill even. The thing carries, just carries so much speed through the middle. It's insane. Hey, I'm going to go way right. right here? Yeah. Let me get some gas for it. You put some air in the tire? Yeah, I did a little bit. All I gotta say is stupid. Dude, it felt really good. Any suspension notice it? Or you notice anything? Specific? It's not bad. The suspension's not bad at all. It just is a it's still a tad bit soft in the rear. Then the front, but I think if we go a little bit stiffer in the rear, even this length, dude, it's, it's insane. That chain, maybe. My, the chain's so loose. Yeah. It's so much easier to ride than any open bike I've ever ridden. Like, I feel like if I can, like, just line up for something, like whether it's a 100 foot wall and stab it, it wouldn't bother me. Like, it's, it feels that good to, like, know that I have more power than I need for a gas bike. I feel like the Bandit's more wrapped out and I'm trying to ride it at its like, the the top, its peak of its power, you know, which is kind of on top, but this thing I can let off anywhere and then stab it again. It's just so ballistic on the bottom and top. It's crazy. Full power range. Full power range, yeah. Like you said, you can let off it and there's still more there. Yeah, exactly. Like that's not the way they, the Bandit is. That what For what I'm used to, like, yeah. I feel like I like it's harder for me to recover on the bandit than it would be forever like for this, you know, like yeah. in any other circumstance. That is a gnarly hill though. It's super intimidating every time you line up for it wide open. It's like, all right, well, I hope I hit the smooth spot. But that's how it is on every hill climb too. <laughs> hope I hit the smooth spot. Zero or hero, baby. And it thing still feels like a 450. Can we make my 450 this fast? Huh? Can we make my 450 this fast? It says RMZ on the side. Hey, your dad made it over. No front fender. <laughs> Short. <laughs> First time riding a 450 in years. Complaining the whole time. Just saying. 
That's impressive. Easy. What's up? Yeah, it's so easy a caveman can do it. Yeah. <laughs> that's a common that's a common uh conversation there with you and me, bro. Who's calling who's calling each other caveman? <laughs>